Hello people and welcome back to my channel. So I just finished the book and it was amazing so I need to talk to you about it. It's this book La Fille du Chaos or Chaos Girl I guess in English. Uh, I checked but it doesn't seem that this book was translated in English yet unfortunately so if you can read Japanese or French well try to read this it's it's really really good. It's by Masahiko Shimada and I never heard of this guy. I was just um, in a bookstore like I do sometimes you know and I was looking at books and I was like this cover is very tacky. It's like in your face. Look at that. Very colorful. So I, I checked it and I was like okay what's the story blah 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 Hmm, that seems very creepy. Ah, I want to read it. <laughs> so yeah, uh, the story is awful. I mean, it's awful. It's so cruel, so cruel. So much bad stuff happened, and it's all told in details, and like you, you can feel awful for the characters. <laughs> it's great. Uh, so you know, it's the kind of story that I like. I, I think. It's better when bad stuff happens if it's not like if it's I mean if it's realistic and bad stuff happened for a reason, not a good reason but a reason, it makes it more tragic, more intense, more powerful, and you can get a message through the story better this way than when they're all optimistic bullshit that I just think life it's not optimistic. I mean, we have to be realistic, people. It's life. Life is pretty bad. I mean, not not your life, especially. Maybe you have a great life, and that's great for you. But I mean, life in general, life for animals in the wild, they have to eat each other. <laughs> life for people, we have wars, we have terrorism, we have lots of poverty, lots of illnesses, lots of everything like. I don't say everything is shit, we have great stuff like books, art, uh, you know, it's, it, you have beauty in, in the world, it's, it's a great thing, but we have to admit that there is also the ugly side of life and it's a very big side of life and, and life it's, it's going through problems and solving them or not solving them and being fucked. So yeah. And so this book is very much like that. It's a it's it's a girl. She goes through a lot. Um, I'm not gonna say anything. It's better if you just read it. But everything awful that can happen to a girl, it happens to her. And it's a parallel between two stories: the story of this girl Mariko, I think, and the story of a boy Naruhiko, who is a shaman. Um, uh, you know his family is uh, from the old people of Japan, the one before the Chinese come to Japan or the Korean, or, I don't know, the one that live in the um, north of Japan, Hokkaido, mostly. It's a complete. It's it's the indigenous people of Japan. It's a complete different culture, and they have lots of shamanism uh, in their culture. And so this guy's family is from there. So. His grandmother was a shaman and he became a shaman too and he has to go through like uh, stuff to become a better shaman like get his powers and shit and it's but you know I I I felt like even though that part of the book wasn't realistic I mean in my opinion I don't believe in spirits I don't believe in uh, magic and stuff and like mediums and I really don't believe in that but in the book it didn't matter because well first it's a book so you know you can have Harry Potter even if magic doesn't exist it still doesn't make it a bad book uh, but in the book specifically in this book it was more like um, a metaphor for all the evil and the good that can happen uh, like the evil can be a demon and it's a metaphor you know and it's it was a very interesting way of telling the story and so I I mean I really really love this book I think 
lots of people will find the shaman part boring and the girl part awful <laughs> like so fucking cruel it's hard to read uh, because it's so cruel uh, but personally I I think both parts were needed like as cruel and boring I, I didn't find it boring but I, I read lots of reviews people find this part boring because it's like you're in the story of the girl lots of awful shit happened and then poof you go to the chapter about the boy and it's like yeah shaman blah 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 and you want to know about the girl but you you you're here reading about the boy and so I, I understand that but I think it was needed and it was very important when you wrap up the story at the end everything made sense and it's, it was so so powerful the story was so wow intense uh, I'm, I'm I really hope that I'm wrong and that it actually exists in English but I really didn't find it so I hope you guys can read it uh, soon maybe because I think it's 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 a new novel here in France even though it's it was published in Japan like a while ago I think in 2007 or something like 10 years ago maybe I don't know but like if it was published in France maybe it will be published in America soon or in England or something I I hope so because you guys have to read this book it's it's so good it's so it's so sad but at the same time you have hope and the message I can't tell you about the message because well it's a spoiler but you don't have to agree with the message of course like I don't I don't fully agree I think it's a bit simplistic maybe but like I don't think it's the message of the author I think it's the message of the characters and the characters are young and so it's normal that what they what they mean by that message is a bit simplistic because they're still young they, they don't have experience in life I mean they do have a lot of experience in author stuff but <laughs> it's not enough to be uh, to, to be mature enough to 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 give a complex op opinion you know but I think it's still very interesting and very hopeful and very beautiful and I I, I, I couldn't stop reading I was reading that every day <laughs> I was trying to not do the thing like, oh, one more chapter and then at 3 in the morning you're still reading. <laughs> I was trying not to do that, so I didn't finish it as quick as I would have liked to, but still, a really good book. So if you find that author, Masahiko Shimada, even if it's not this book, find uh, a book from him and I'm sure they're all good, I'm going to read more books from him, but he writes very well and it's it's very good very intense very profound you know so yeah um, I see you soon for a figure review don't forget to subscribe leave a comment like the video all the YouTube stuff and I'll see you next time bye